like to welcome Rock Raider. Let's hear it up for him. Back in like 80, 81, there weren't that many hip hop records. Like you, you barely could have a crate of hip hop records because it's just hip hop wasn't that big yet. At 12 years old, I had, <laughs> as crazy as it sounded, at 12 years old, I was a DJ in a club, like in a nightclub. <laughs> with just grown people, I'm playing music with curses on it, and you kiss my ass, and I'm 12 years old doing this, but it's crazy. Actually, the first person I battled was uh, Lord Finesse, the rapper, at the Apollo. And Finesse, Finesse beat me fair and square. <laughs> But after that night, I swore, I was like, man, Finesse is my man, but he's a rapper. There's no way I'm trying to be a battle DJ and I'm getting beat out by rappers. <laughs> so, <laughs> so that was like the turning point for me. Like that, right after that, that whole summer, like I was like in the military, like I would just wake up, okay, it's 10 o'clock, we practice to 2 o'clock. If I do good, I'll allow myself to go outside, right? So I would come up with like routines and at the end of the, you know, like, come 1.30, if I'm able to pull that routine off flawless without any mistakes, then I can go outside and enjoy myself. But if not, then I'm going to stick myself in the house for a couple more hours so I get that routine perfect. Next we got up actually is Rock Ryder. Yeah. It's a bit of a demonstration. He's going to be carving it up.